Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk about the flip belt. And the reason that I'm doing this review now is because when I did my recent uh, upload, which was about my favourite ways to carry water on a run, a few of you messaged me and asked why I didn't include this belt, saying that did I know that the belt also had the potential to carry water. I did know that and I've actually got one of the bottles that go with the belt but there's a reason I didn't include it in my favourites and I'll explain that to you as we go on in the video. Let's get started. So I've got two of these belts. The first one is the classic belt which uh, was I've had this for a couple of years now uh, and the second one here is my newest one which is the zippered one. I think they've made this zippered one um, to make it more secure at the front but um, it, nothing's ever fallen out for me because the idea behind the belt is that you place your items in these in these open pockets all around and then flip it over around your waist and it holds everything very securely. So I'm just going to use this belt to go through this review. So, so one thing I love about the belt is its capacity, it can carry such a lot with you. So here are some of the items I take. So I take my phone with me and you just open the slots and slide the items in. So that's the phone in there. Also obviously keys, quite a big bunch there, but what's great about this little pocket here is it has a clip. So you can pop those on there and know that they're going to stay put during the run. So I pop those in there. Two items turning over. I also like to take this really useful little purse with me. I carry some cash in the front and then in the zippered bit, I just carry a credit card for emergencies. And then I'll slide that in. Another thing I like to take is, always take with me, is some baby wipes, which I just keep in a little bag. Talking of that bag, actually, if we go back to the front, I mean, this is summer now and it's not raining very much, so I don't think about this as often, but I do take, tend to put my phone in one of these as well, because this is not waterproof. I have been out when it's rained and the phone doesn't get very wet but um, it's on my mind all the time if it's raining I'm worried about my phone so I pop it in one of these little waterproof bags before I put it in there. And now another thing that does fit is a couple of gels. I don't tend to use these but I'm just sort of um, showing you that you can carry these in there as well quite quite happily. So moving on to the bottle. This is the flip belt bottle custom made for the belt. And it's, as you, if you can see, it's got this gentle curvature to this side here, which actually is fantastic and makes it super comfortable against, against your body weight wherever you choose to wear it. Now this is where it kind of falls short for my favorite ways to carry water. First of all, there's only 300 mil in there. You can get another couple of small bottles or another large one, but then for me, I'd be filling my whole belt with water and wouldn't have the space to carry all the other items. So I've just got one of these and I do use it. So basically I like to put it at the back. I definitely like my keys to be attached to the, the clip and I definitely like to access my phone a lot during the run, taking pictures and different things. So my chosen place is here at the back. So. The, what I tend to do is flip it first because then you get the curve rise against your back. So let's turn this around like this. So this is how you would wear it. You'd step into it and wriggle it up over, over your waist or hips, wherever you want to wear it. Now you can open this and then just, you've got, you want that to be against your body. So you just slide it in like this. It goes in quite easily like that. And then can you see you'll have that gentle curve against your back and it's very, very comfortable. The only thing is it's nigh on impossible to access this when you're running. If you wear it like I do at my back, I'm sure flip belt would say I should wear it around the front, but it's not so bad to pull out. So you can pull out 
and, and get your drink. But getting it back in whilst you're on the run is very difficult. Um, the other thing that I'm not keen on on this bottle is I find this, let's push it down at the moment, I find this cap very stiff. I almost feel like my teeth are going to go trying to pull it up. I can't get it up now. There you go, it's up now, but um, maybe with more use it will loosen up a bit, but it's, it's a stiff top. Um, it's, it's, an, it's an ingenious curved bottle. I love that idea, but uh, the, for the reasons I've just said, it isn't one of my favourite ways to carry water, but the belt itself is one of my favourite ways to carry other items on the run. Now you can get this belt in lots of different colours and also in different sizes and Flip Belt have um, a, a handy size chart on their website so you can decide which size works for you. I've got a medium. It needs to fit really snugly, you don't want it to be loose at all so it keeps everything really secure against your body. It can go into the washing machine so it's easy to wash. Now Flip Belt maintain that the belt will hold all sizes of foam, which is fantastic. I've also heard that there's um, a new Flip Belt Elite, which has is waterproof and has extra uh, non-slip coating inside and also has a clip, I think, at the side, so you don't have to actually step into the belt, that you can just fasten it, but I haven't seen one of those yet. There's also some um, crop leggings and shorts with a flip belt built in as the waistband, so lots of great stuff coming from Flip Belt. I can't wait to try it all because it's definitely a really fantastic piece of kit.